Volleyball defeated James Madison University for the first time in its program's history. They defeated the Dukes 3 to 1 at home yesterday evening. And as you may or may not know, our usual morning anchor, Isabel Seaman, also serves as captain of the volleyball team. She's been out off the court and away from the teleprompter following a concussion, but she joins us live this morning to talk about the team's success. And Bella, we are very happy to see you. I'm very happy to see you guys, and I miss you so much. I can't wait to get back in the studio, but I got to take care of my brain first. You do. It's, yeah, Bella, how did it feel um, to be a part of this team when you accomplished such a historic win? You know, we've, this team has worked so hard, day in and day out. It's a weird season, obviously, but we knew we had really high skilled players, and the senior class, especially with the win last night, it was our last home game. And so to beat JMU at our last home game as seniors together, just really meant the world to us. And we know we have a really, really exciting future for um, our last conference weekend this weekend and then CAA, the CAA tournament right after. So tell us a little bit what we should expect this weekend. What we expect this weekend, well, College Charleston's always a really solid team. They're probably one of our rivals. So we're going to travel to their gym, which is very similar to the Char Center. It's going to be really nice uh, and sunny down there, actually. So we're just really excited that we have the opportunity to compete, especially during a pandemic. All right, Isabel Seaman, a D1 athlete and a D1 uh, journalist here in Elon <laughs> News Network as well. Thank you for joining Thank us. Thank you, guys. <laughs>